I have here the Go Lift by Comfy Go Mobility. This is a portable lightweight lift. This lift can lift up to 100 pounds. So if you have a lightweight folding scooter or a break apart scooter that has parts under 100 pounds and you have trouble lifting that into your vehicle, you can load them onto this lift, then have this lift do, well, the lifting, get it up to vehicle height and then slide it into your vehicle. So if you do have any issues, I'll demonstrate the lift first. It has a remote control right here. And you can see it'll go up to about 35 inches tall. Um, that should fit most vehicles. Um, <clears throat> now, like I said, this lift has a 100 pound lifting capability. This lift is not meant for people, only scooters. Um, so as I'm lifting, you'll see these side wheels come out and then start to stabilize it. I'm gonna go all the way up just to show you how tall it can get. This lift also comes with a little side pouch. Uh, this side pouch has little snap-ons. You can put it on either side or you can remove it completely. It's pretty optional. Uh, as you can see, we're still going up on this lift. So it does go quite high. So here's the maximum height. Uh, it's right about waist level to me. And you, as you can see, it rolls quite easily. So you can load your scooter on here, roll it to wherever you need to go. So one thing on this lift I wanna talk about is the battery. The battery is a five amp hour lithium ion battery. You can see it down there. The battery can be disconnected from the unit. There's two screws underneath. You could probably see them. Then you just pull this cable out and you can charge the battery separate from the unit if you do want to char leave the unit inside your vehicle and charge it inside your home. This is a lithium battery. You are going to want to charge this regularly that will prolong the lifespan of your battery. Uh, if you do let it sit for five, six months without charging, it can kill the battery. You should be getting three to five years out of these. Um, <clears throat> but these are lithium batteries. You are gonna want to charge them. You will get a charger with your unit as well. Um, but there is a quick disconnect in there. These batteries are also airline and cruise ship approved, so you can bring them with you. Um, and then this whole unit weighs 25 pounds. So, if you have a travel scooter, like I've got a transformer here, we're gonna lift up in a second, weighs about 57 pounds. So if you have a travel scooter that you can't lift, but you can lift 25 pounds, this lift is great for that. Now I'm gonna demonstrate how to use this lift. First thing I've done, there are safety straps uh, that go over the unit. You can leave them strapped together for storage. I've got them out of the way for extra safety. I'm going to strap this down when I get it on here. Uh, but if it is secure on there, that's not necessary. It's just an extra step you can take. The other thing I have is my remote control is out of the way. I have it stored in here. I do not want to put my unit on top of the remote and potentially damage it. So now that everything is set up, you'll notice what if it rolls while I'm trying to load a scooter onto it. There are on all the wheels little uh, brakes you can push down right down here. So I did these back ones that will not roll back on me. So now you could do all four. I'm just gonna do the back two for now. That should be enough. And then what I can do, a lot of these travel scooters roll. I can roll it up to my lift, tilt it back, kind of take the weight off of it, and then just slide it on. You can see it's pretty stable on there. Like I said, for extra safety, we can bring our straps over and hold it down. Just an extra precaution. I can unleash, unleash these brakes down here and I can move this unit as need be. Now, like I said, I put the remote control in this safety pouch on the side so it doesn't get damaged. And now I'm going to lift this scooter up. So this is the transformer. It weighs about 57 pounds. Um, this lift has no problem carrying that. Like I said, it has a 100 pound carrying capacity. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just lift this to about the size of the trunk. And once I get it to where I want it, I'm actually going to spin the lift around uh, because I can use these wheels to roll it into the vehicle. Uh, every scooter will kind of fit on here different. You might have your own way of doing it, whether you have a folding power chair or one of these, um, but it will definitely make it a lot easier. That cuts a lot of the lifting up. Something that's you know 50, 60 pounds up to waist height, this cuts a lot of that out. So now I'm pretty close to the height of the vehicle. I'm gonna put my remote in a safe place. 
We're gonna spin this around, get it pretty close to the trunk. Then I'm gonna put these wheel chocks back in just so it doesn't roll behind me. Undo these safety straps. And now I can tilt this forward. There we go. Then it can just roll right into the vehicle. I didn't have to do any lifting. Just kind of use gravity, let it let the gravity and the lift do all the work. Uh, then the same thing to get it out. You roll it, tilt it, bring it down, and then pull it off from there. But once again, this has been the Go Lift by Comfy Go Mobility. If you like this product, or if you have any other questions, feel free to give us a call. Thank you for watching. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6293. Thank you and have a wonderful day.